So I'm here in the Delahiva. I have his collar to break the posture. My foot and the bicep is keeping him spread out like this. And it's almost impossible for him to put his arm anywhere but my shin here, okay? He can, he's either gonna have to push on my shin to get rid of the Delahiva, or he's gonna grab my collar. But for now, let's work with the shin. So he starts to push on my knee or shin to open the deli hipa. Boom. I open my leg out. I grab John's tricep. And now I'm going to open up his elbow like this with my grip. And I'm going to kick at the same time. Once I get his elbow nice and tight into my hip, look, my foot is going to go right here on John's belt. And as soon as I get my foot here, I'm going to lift my hips off the mat and pinch his shoulder. Boom. The whole time I'm maintaining this grip on the collar and I'm keeping everything tight with this grip on his tricep, okay? So I usually don't like to use the grip on the gi because the grip on the gi can start to, to give and it will start to move. But when I grab onto his arm like this, it's really tight and it's not going anywhere. So I bridge, pinch, and I'm in this nice strong position here. Now from here, I'm gonna throw my leg over the top and like I was saying earlier, I'm crossing my legs here at the feet and not the full triangle. Now I'm pinching my knees. This arm comes up to make sure he doesn't jump over me to the other side. Can you show him that once for me, jump? Yep, because from here, this is a bad situation. I'm gonna need to do a lot to recover. Go back. So I place his hand up, making sure he doesn't jump. I control his hips. My knees come to my chest. And now I'm extending and sitting up. Now I can start to go to the finish, or if he rolls, I can come up for the sweep. We are here, boom, we go there, boom, 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 boom. Yes. In this part here, you say not to, not to put the foot over there, right? Mm-hmm. And the set. Yep. Put over there where you put. Don't you afraid of the guy bring you over here? Yeah, but uh, I see his lock here, right? Yeah, when I when How I do you lock him here? Because some guy's gonna blow. Mm -hmm. That's what happened with me when I'm on the bottom. I don't... Whoa, whoa, whoa. You, you grab it. Yeah, you... that's exactly why I'm trying to cross my ankles here and pinch my knees. So, oh, so you put... When I cross my legs like this, oh, yeah. I feel like I'm not getting that same control over your shoulder. So when I cross my ankles, I have the grip on the collar, and I'm pinching my knees here. You see how it bends your arm? Yes. And then at now the same time, stretch. really tight. Yeah. yeah. Also, anytime I lock like this, I feel like the yeah. guy has a really strong posture ability. You know what happened here? They, they start to yeah. jump here over. Yeah. And I, I feel that when you pinch, it's, it's, it's hard to jump over. Mm-hmm. But, then, that, but that doesn't limit you for sit up or no? Well, I also use that to sit up as well. So when I lock my ankles here, I pull my knees to my chest. Oh, okay. And then once I get my knees to my chest, I'm gonna extend, let go of your collar, and then place my hand on the mat. Okay. Once my hand goes on the mat, I'm bringing my hips back. Now I can start to hug your hips and control. I try yeah, to keep like a ball right on your shoulder. That is terrible. 